Yo fam, it's your girl, Amanda, and I got a new video for you today. <laughs> that was my gangsta persona. <laughs> okay, anyways, so today I went to Marshall's and did a little bit of birthday shopping for Josh because his birthday is in two weeks, two weeks. I picked up a few things for Josh as a surprise on his birthday. So while I was there, I couldn't help but notice that there was a ton of cool, cute clothes for like less than $15, okay? Now, one item is a little expensive, but let's just see if you know the OG fam jam can guess right off the bat it's from Marshalls and it's a little bit expensive what do you think it is comment down below what you think it might be I'll give you a minute so I'm not gonna show any of the things that I got Josh for his birthday because my honey bunny might just want to peek and watch the whole video just to see what kind of stuff I got him. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But I definitely do want to show you what I picked up at Marshall's today. It's nothing crazy, it's not a huge haul, it's just like a mini Marshall's spring haul. <laughs> and the first item I picked up is this e.l.f moisturizing foundation stick in nude now don't let the color at the bottom there fool you it's not that dark it's a little bit lighter than like my skin tone but I don't always like to wear you know like foundation and concealer and then powder and setting and blah 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 especially not in the warm months spring is okay but on those hot days in spring nah -uh. and definitely not when it's super hot in the summertime so i have a little trick that i like to do instead of that but it's still full coverage it still looks like it's a full glam kind of face setup but it's a lot lighter and a little less product. So if you would like to see my summer foundation routine full coverage but light AF, <laughs> let me know down below because I want to share as much stuff as I can with you guys. Like this spring and summer is going to be like me honest to goodness taking it to the next level. I promise you that. These next two items I got were both on clearance, which is, yes, amazeballs. <laughs> and the first item is these adorable, they are low rise, so, you know, they sit more on your hips. That's why it's a little bit wider of a waist because it does sit on your hips. And it has an adorable light wash on them. It's so freaking cute. And yes, they are wanna bet a butt. <laughs> I love these because they have smaller pockets on the back. I find, now this is just my personal opinion, when you have shorts with the longer pockets, depending on the style, it can give you a real bad case of flat butt. And nobody wants a flat butt, right? <laughs> they have the three buttons at the top with a short little zipper. And on the back, there is a little bit of detail on the pockets. And I just die for the fold. I think that is so freaking cute. And these were on clearance for 15 bucks. And considering that they are the Better Butt and the YMI brand, that's pretty darn good. They're usually anywhere from 25 to 30 bucks in the store, so bam, I say that's a win. <laughs> now this second item that I found in clearance, 
Oh my goodness, guys. Like, I can't even express to you how freaking adorable this is. Like, picture a pair of distressed sort of shorts that you would find on like Fashion Nova, okay? And okay, those are pretty badass, right? Okay, well, take it up like 150 notches. That's what I found at Marshall's today. <laughs> and they were on clearance. Oh, yes. <laughs> are you ready to see them? Be prepared, this is a total warning, okay? You may need to sit down because these are adorable. Okay, they are these denim distressed American Eagle shorts, okay? But take a look at all of that detail on the front and how colorful and fun they are. There's a flower printed on this side. Over here, there's a whole bunch of speckles. And what I absolutely love is the distressing right in the front of the legs. <gasps> so freaking cute. And that's not even, like, this is cute, okay? But this is to die for. Bam! This is what the back looks like. It has speckles up on the top, and it also has, let me see if I can get this to show good. It has like a city line right here underneath the speckles in black, so cute. And then, boom, it has a huge print on the other butt cheek, and yes, it says, I love ya. And there's, I am in love with like the white paint splatters and like paint smears. I think these are absolutely to die for. When I seen them, I was like, please Lord, let them be in my size. Please Lord, let them be in my size. Oh my goodness, fashion queen, please let it be. And sure enough, there was only one pair. And yes, it was my Size. Now these are high-waisted, which is even better, and they are stretchy, so they are comfortable, and they're American Eagle brand. Like, I didn't even really know American Eagle made, like, super cute, super trendy, like, stuff like this. I had no idea. And these were $13. 13 on clearance. You see that red sticker right there? Yes. So this last clothing item, oddly enough, I found it in the men's section, but I thought it was like a mistake. But come to find out, it's actually a men's shirt, but screw gender roles, right? Who cares? Boys can wear girls and girls can wear boys, okay? I'm cool with it. I love you either way. <laughs> And this you might also kind of have like a heart palpitation just a bit because it's so freaking cute and it was only $12.99 and that was the regular price, okay? Like, that's it. And it is, oh, you see that adorable star print there? <gasps> It's My Little Pony. Oh my goodness, it has rainbow hair. It's got the star tattoo on her butt. Oh, and the white, oh my goodness, she stands right out. A little rainbow up over here. It says My Little Pony. Oh, wow. Like, do you see how adorable that is? Like the rainbow hair gets me, you know? Like I cannot wait to wear this like everywhere, you know? I might like maybe trim it up a bit in some places just to make it a little like more fitted and feminized because this is a men's shirt. But still, hella cute. I ain't gonna complain, $12.99. Yes, that is so up my alley. Okay guys, are you ready for this last item? Now, whoever guessed it in the comments is the bomb and knows me so freaking well. Ah, I'm so excited to show you. <laughs> the moment I laid eyes on this, 
I fell in love. It, it was gorgeous. And to be honest, I was a little disappointed that there wasn't more of them there. But I found this one and that's all that matters because it's so freaking cute. And okay, I'll stop blabbing about it. Here we go. Ah! I got a new Betsy Johnson bag. And I know I've had Betsy bags before. The colors aren't really coming up that well on camera, but this is pastel pink, like a very, very sweet pastel pink. And these colors here, like the grayish beige looking, is exactly that, but more on the gray side with just a tiny bit of the beige. To lighten it up just a bit and then on the back we have the infamous Betsy Johnson little plaque right there in gold which is adorable and one of the fine details on the front is this right here it's a little gold locket it doesn't open or you can't remove it, but it's just so dainty and adorable there. What I love about this bag is if you guys seen my previous hauls of the Betsy Johnson bags that I've got, they, most of them, sorry, have crazy bright prints, floral, pattern, whatever. But this one is definitely screaming spring and summer to me. And it's also more, I guess you would say, mature. <laughs> but it's still gorgeous. It has the like arm hold like this if you want. And the great thing about these bags is they give you the longer strap with it. So if you're like going out shopping or something like that, it's not always great to carry it by this. So you can put it on, you know, the strap like this and just carry your bag normal. But I don't like to if I don't have to because I feel like this hanging like looks stupid on the bag and you can't tuck them in. So that's just a personal preference though. And what else is really cool is the closure on the top isn't a magnet, isn't a zipper. It's like a little clasp like that. I guess like a carabiner, but prettier that you like open like this and then it locks to a little like ring right there. It's kind of hard to see, but sorry guys then look at that floral print there absolutely gorgeous and it has a big pocket here a little secure zip pocket there in the center and then another large pocket there so freaking cute i love this bag it's so adorable it's so sweet like that's the vibes I get when I look at it it's like a sweet looking girly girl kind of bag which I also love but I love a statement piece too but this is sort of a statement piece with the big ass bow right <laughs> and this purse here was $49.99 which was really good considering that other like larger bags that I got of Betsy Johnson were $59.99 so I don't know if maybe the price is a little different because it doesn't have like the crazy print and the crazy like tassels or whatever which I ain't gonna complain because like I said this is like a more mature <laughs> bag but it's still hella adorable still totally my aesthetic I absolutely love it so okay now is the most important question for you guys now would you be interested in seeing a complete purse collection because you know your girl has some pretty adorable purses, if I do say so myself. So please let me know about the purse collection and if you'd like to see that. So 
If you haven't already and you're not a part of the fam jam, you should hit that subscribe button because like, what are you waiting for? Like, we lit a F up in here. <laughs> Oh, sorry, I should be gangsta now because um, uh, it's the outro. So, yo, if you're not already, hit that subscribe button, yo. Join the crew. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Anyways, guys, don't forget to follow me on all of my social medias because why not, right? I love you guys. <laughs> and with all...